You can know a country by its music. This is the story of American music and the people who created it. Blues people, black music in America. Part four, rock and roll. What do you get when you take a blues rhythm and add a driving backbeat? You get something entirely new. Rock and roll, a deeply American musical form shaped largely by African Americans such as Fats Domino. Fats represents the first wave of rock, still featuring a strong piano and saxophone line in front of a heavy blues beat. Artists like Little Richard took rock a little step further, keeping the piano up front, but banging that beat out ever harder. That let loose, go wild kind of performance defined what it meant to rock for the coming decades. Other black rockers took the music to new heights from Ray Charles to Big Joe Turner to Lloyd Price. Mama But something magical happened when Chuck Berry plugged in his electric guitar and gave rock and roll its signature instrumentation and sound, taking the guitar solo and all out enthusiastic performances to their peak. Barry's influence on rock was so deep that the Beach Boys scored a hit with their song Surf and Safari just by penning new lyrics to Barry's Sweet Little Sixteen. Many white artists joined in and added their contributions to rock and roll in those early days, people like Elvis and Buddy Holly. But rock owes its existence to the blues and to the black Americans who gave the blues a driving backbeat, creating a music that still keeps the world rockin' and rollin'.